Okay, students. Then in the previous part we saw that the sentence consists of two parts. That is, first part is subject part, and second is predicate. And in the predicate there is verb and object. Now we will see in this exercise encircle the subject and underline the predicate in the given sentences. So first sentence is there. We respect our teachers and elders. So here, which is the subject? Yes, subject is we. Circle V and underline respect our teachers and elders. Second sentence is there. The child swam across the river. So here, ask the question to the verb who is doing, who is swimming, the child. So the child is subject, circle the subject, the child, swam across the river, underline it. Third is there, my sister walks in the park daily. So students, write again, I am telling you again, my sister walks in the park daily. So in this sentence, subject is my sister and predicate is walks in the park daily. Fourth one, the peon rings the bell. Here the subject who is ringing the bell, peon. So the peon is the subject, rings the bell is the predicate. And rings is the verb and the bell is object. Rainfall is essential for a harvest. So here rainfall in subject place is essential for a harvest is a object. Underline it. Then six sentence is there. Down the river went the wooden boat. Now see here, ask the question to the verb who is going down. So answer is the wooden boat. See that the subject is there in the after the predicate. But you have to identify who is doing that. That is the subject. It may be at the place of object or at the place of subject. So here the wooden boat is there in the object place but still it's a subject so the under a circle the wooden boat and underline down the river went okay students have you done it now we will see the types of sentences there are four types of sentences the first type is assertive sentence or Declarative sentence. So this sentence is also called as statement. Assertive, declarative. The second type is imperative sentence. Imperative sentence means advice, command. These types of requests, these types of sentence are called as imperative sentences. Third is exclamatory sentence. You, when you want to show any strong feeling, oh, when you are sad, wow, when you are seeing anything amazing. So that word sentence are exclamatory sentences. And the next is interrogative sentences. Interrogative sentences means questions. It may be WH question or it may be yes no type question. WH questions, it starts with what, when, where, which, how. These are WH questions. And yes, no means where the helping words are used. Could you, will you, are you. So these are the yes, no type of questions.